Some parents in a Luzerne County School District say that their kids are being cyber bullied and they claim that nothing is being done about it. They reached out to the I team to look into the situation. 2822 Eyewitness News lead I team reporter Andy Mahalchik joins us live in the studio with the story. Andy. Well, good evening, Julie and Nick. Parents at Crestwood High School tell this reporter they are frustrated about the situation, so we went looking for answers. Parents tell the I team that profane comments are being made about their children, all teenage girls on social media platform Instagram. The comments, they say, are sexual in nature. Now, parents did not want to appear on camera or be identified, fearing that would result in cyber backlash for their kids. One mother sent Eyewitness News a statement that reads, in part, the cowards who posted heinous and untrue things about them on the social media platform called Instagram don't even have the courage to identify themselves. They post under a cloak of anonymity protected by Instagram. The alleged cyberbullying was reported to school officials and the Wright Township Police Department. The police department determined the posts were not a threat and they could not take action, at least at this point in time. We spoke with Luzerne County District Attorney Sam Sangodochi, who is not involved in the investigation, but tells the I-team. It's a case-by-case -case basis. It's very fact-specific. You know, just one comment alone usually doesn't qualify, you know, to file charges. Sangodochi says many of these cyberbullying cases are not cut and dry. It's a difficult issue for law enforcement. Obviously, we have a balance between, you know, your First Amendment rights and protecting children or people of any age, really, against uh, this type of bullying. Robert Mahalik is superintendent of the Crestwood School District. He says they've made efforts to track down those responsible for the cyberbullying. We are attacking this through education, uh, bringing our students together in assemblies and different sorts of programs um, and, and showing them that, uh, these type of things, they, they really hurt and they last a long, long time. Dr. Matthew Berger is a psychiatrist who has dealt with teenagers who have been the victims of cyberbullying. He has this advice for parents. Talk to your child. Definitely talk to your child. Ask them what's going on. If you see your child being more sullen, uh, not interacting, you know, signs of depression, signs of anxiety, not wanting to go to school, talk to them. Ask them what's going on. And no doubt about it, cyberbullying is happening everywhere. In fact, Lackawanna County created what they call a threat assessment team to deal with these types of situations. Also, a spokesperson for Instagram emailed the I team and said they do take steps to prevent cyberbullying and have even installed technical measures on its platform to help protect people. We have more information on that on pahomepage.com.